What's going on everybody? It's iPod King Carter here, the Super Mini YouTube. And I'm here to talk about Metal Gear Solid 5. Now, um, you guys may not know, but um, I was a PlayStation head in the beginning. You know, I never was about Xbox One. So Metal Gear Solid was something I always happened to look for when it came out. The last one, of course, that I played was Metal Gear Solid 4, Guns of Patriots. Now, that was a beast game, like, without a doubt, beast but now we got the phantom pain coming out now this is not futuristic or nothing like that the actual game setting was back in 1975 and then moved on nine years to 1984 so you know the weapons and some of that stuff is kind of old but you know some i could still work with now what you're looking at on screen is you know a little cinematic entrance and stuff like that you know just you know coolness but uh <laughs> The reason that I'm going to be getting this game is, you know, simply that it's Metal Gear Solid. And should I give you another reason why I'm getting it? But the one thing that I am pissed about is that it's now coming out on all platforms. It's going to be out on PlayStation 3. It's going to be out on Xbox 360. It's going to be out on PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. That's what kills me. Now, the release date is to be announced. You know, they haven't announced anything new, but there are a lot of new things added into this game, such as, you know, what you just saw with him trying to be stealth on a horse. That's, that's dope, though. I, I like the way they did that. Um, it says real time weather. You know, it'll be different weather conditions, you know, as you move on throughout the game and stuff like that. You know, like it won't be snowing in the desert. You know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. Um, also, the modes of transport is dope. You know, I like that, you know, you're able to drive the tanks, the cars, the horses, you know, anything you want. But one big thing that I am psyched about is that this is open world. This is not just, you, you know, follow a straight line and then you can't veer off to the left or veer off to the right. You got to stay straight, stay on the objective. You actually get to roam around in this world. Now, my thing about this game is I hope that the fight scenes are just as dope as they were in metal gear solid 4 if not better i know that the graphics are dope as hell like the graph you can already tell on screen that the graphics surpass anything you've seen really you know but one big thing that i am so psyched about is the boy sutherland now if you don't know who Kiefer sutherland is he's an actor of course um he played in 24 one of the best TV series I've ever seen in my life. And that's what made me become a big fan of Sutherland. Now, he's the voice of Snake. And that right there alone makes me want to put down on all four games for each council. But I'm only going to go with one game. Now, I've done a lot of deciding. I've thought about it. And I have decided to wait until PlayStation 4 comes out. Now, I'm not going to get it on Xbox One, I'm not going to get it on Xbox 360, and I'm not even going to get it on PS3. Now, my thing is, a lot of people are going to be in the comment section saying, Apa, why don't you get it for PlayStation 3 and do a walkthrough so you can be one of the first people with it up? I'm really not worried about being one of the first people up with the game. I'm worried about actually having fun with the game, actually looking at beast graphics with this game, you know, on the next gen console. And I can veer away from PlayStation. You know, I, I've known nothing but PlayStation when it comes to Metal Gear Solid. So I'm going to stay with that. Now, what you're looking at on screen is, you know, new characters. You know, uh, they had the first guy. You got this little sniper chick named Quiet. Uh, Eli. You know, uh, you'll, you'll look at the, the characters as it goes. But I do like that the game setting is in, you know, like past times, you know, in the 70s and 80s. It's pretty cool. Um, the one person that I do like, I do like Squallface. I ain't gonna lie. The way that boy looked, it looked like he might be a beast. Like at the end of the game, you know, I I would like to see a, a Metal Gear Solid 5 fight scene like how I was in a Metal Gear Solid 4. You know, just hand to hand combat, you and him, mano a mano. But hey, it is what it is. You know, things things happen for a reason. You know, but um, as it goes for the Phantom Pain, you could definitely expect it on my channel for PS4 only. You know, so uh, just expect the walkthrough by then. Hey, if the game comes out before PlayStation 4 launches and I see a couple walkthroughs and stuff like that, hey, you know, I may take those in the heat, you know, watch closely. You know, most likely my boy X Chase Money gonna come out with it if it drops on a uh, 
the uh, current gen councils, but you know how the game go. But this is IKC signing out. Hope you guys have a nice day. I got a lot more videos from E3 dropping soon. So, you know, just wait on those. <laughs> but I'm out of here, man. Y'all stay up. Peace. Calls for wet work, and we answer it. No greater good. No just cause. <laughs>